Today's Student Athlete Spotlight brought to you by Play It Again Sports features William Campbell multi-sports senior Joey Yoder. Joey has played four different sports for the Generals, cross country, golf, basketball, and outdoor track. And Joey, obviously you love sports and you like staying busy. Why is that and have you been that way since you were a little kid? Yes, I've never been able to hold still and so I've always sort of turned to athletics. Of all the sports that you've competed in at William Campbell High School, what is your favorite and why? My favorite is definitely basketball. It's a very social sport. There's a lot of improvement to have there and I get to improve alongside my teammates. That helps a lot. So that's your favorite. What do you feel like was your best sport? Was basketball your best sport? No, basketball was not my best sport. I enjoy it a lot, but I'm not particularly skilled. Uh, my best sport is probably cross country. I ran in states my uh, sophomore year, I believe. And because of um, injuries and such, I wasn't able to compete uh, in the state tournament in junior or senior year, but I was uh, very competitive in that sport. What are some of your best memories at William Campbell as far as sports competition? Probably uh, basketball practices. It can be very competitive and uh, very challenging, but it's really fun to be able to compete alongside my friends. Uh, my best friend's on the basketball team, Joey Eisenman, and he's an extreme athlete and pushes me to, you know, compete further and that really has driven me. Joey, how have high school sports helped you grow as a person? They have taught me how to deal with setbacks as well as success, really. You know, learning to compete hard and still lose was one of the hardest things I've had to learn, but it really does help to have a good group of guys around me that, you know, are in the same boat. You're very good in the classroom. You're already taking pre-college courses. What, uh, what subjects really pique your interest? So one of the biggest courses that I enjoy would probably be physics. Uh, it's like a very, you know, can be a very physical, hands-on, problem-solving type of course. And I really enjoy being able to put pieces together to figure stuff out. I really enjoy, um, we had an anatomy course that was a lot of biology and physical stuff that I was able to piece stuff together on how stuff worked, how the body functioned, and I really enjoyed that. Outside of school, you're active in the community, especially with your church. Tell us a little bit about that. I am part of our church youth group. I have worked as a leader, the vice president actually, but I had to cut that short due to medical reasons. But um, I really enjoy it. We do a lot of volunteer work as well as like studying, game nights, uh, just really hanging out and building up the community. You mentioned medical issues this past October. You, you got some really tough news. Yes, so in October I was diagnosed with cancer and we had it surgically resolved. Everything went well, I returned to school and regular activity um, after several weeks of being out. Um, it didn't set me back too badly and I was able to function afterwards, but the real hit really did come in February when I was re-diagnosed with lung cancer. So that was the one that uh, really affected me. Joey, was your cancer found in a routine physical or were you having health concerns that prompted you to go see a doctor? Yes, so um, I just had some health concerns that we went to see the doctor and when I got checked out they discovered some, um, you know, deformities and they went from there, uh, proceeded to professionals and discovered it, yeah. It had to be a shock to your system when you got the diagnosis. What were you thinking and how have you dealt with that over the past several months? You know, obviously that's not a diagnosis anybody wants to hear. And it was really hard for the first couple weeks. But I have to play it day by day, you know. It's very different than anything I've ever been through. But being surrounded by community, uh, family, friends, and you know, my faith in Jesus Christ, you know, has really led me through everything. And it's been a lot smoother than I expected it to be. You're in the midst of your chemotherapy treatments now, yes. and you'll be doing it for the next uh, several weeks. What, what have you really struggled dealing with? One of the hardest parts was some of the side effects from the chemotherapies we got. Um, I had a, an infusion of, I think it was bleomycin, which means nothing to most people, but 
it's a chemotherapy that specifically attacks uh, bone marrow and you know fast producing cells. Mine on a particular day attacked my bone marrow and I struggled with extreme joint and bone pain. And the only thing I can compare it to was when I broke my wrist or my leg. And it's just a really deep ache that you can't get rid of. And that lasted for, I think it was well over seven hours of just me laying on the couch. And there wasn't much to do about it. And that was really hard. But the worst part of the whole process has been watching the people around me hurt. Yeah, it's really hard to watch my parents have to deal with this, and especially my brothers and sisters. You've got high school graduation coming up here very shortly. What are your plans after William Campbell? So after William Campbell, I'm going to attend Liberty in the fall to complete two years to complete my bachelor's because early college uh, gives me an associate's degree uh, by the time I graduate high school. But I'll go to Liberty for two years and then I'm going to go on to Virginia Tech for another, I think, four years at their vet school and hopefully from there, you know, start my own clinic with some affiliates and start my own business. What got you interested in vet school and that, in that line of work? Uh, way back when, uh, I think it was sixth or seventh grade, I started working as a farmhand for a local farmer and I worked there for a full summer, really enjoyed it, came back the next summer, really enjoyed it, working alongside vets, animals, you know, the whole nine yards. And I did the same thing at a different farm for the next two years. So I had four years as a farmhand. I just really enjoyed it. I've grown up on a farm and I've just always been drawn there, so. Joey, it's been a real pleasure talking with you. Thank you. Yes, thank you very much. That's Joey Yoder, William Campbell, senior standout athlete. Today's Student Athlete Spotlight presented by Play It Again Sports.